Professional boxing will return to the Olympic Park later this year after a deal was signed with a major promoter. The Copper Box, which was the venue for handball during the Games, will become a new home for top-class boxing in East London. This deal will also subsidise the Aquatic Centre so that local people can swim for less. Our sports news correspondent, Adrian Warner, reports. In London's Albert Hall, the Army's boxing stars held their championships. Boxing has had a few homes in London over the years, the Albert Hall here in the 1940s and Wembley's Indoor Arena. But this is the sport's new home in the capital, the Copper Box. During the Olympics, it hosted handball. And in September, it will stage its first British title fight between middleweights Billy Joe Saunders from Hatfield and Islington's John Ryder. 7,000 it holds, so um, it's going to be, it's going to be, you, know, you better cut the tension with a knife in there, I suppose. I mean, there's going to be a lot of fans there for me, and I suppose John's side as well, and um, cheering us both on, so it's going to give us the incentive to pull that more out of the bag. The promoter, Frank Warren, has signed a deal for six big nights in the next year. It gives us a chance to develop London fighters on a regular basis. We're going to do six shows per year there, so they'll be quite big shows. Can we expect in those in the first six uh, shows a uh, world title? Fight? Absolutely. Um, as I said, we've got a big fight that we will be announcing probably about two weeks' time for the, for the 21st of September at the Copper Box. So once we've got that finally signed off, that'll be added to the show. Now, of course, East London already has a traditional home for boxing. York Hall here in Bethnal Green. It's been around since the 1920s, but it's much smaller than the Copper Box. So will this mean the end of York Hall? The company GLL, which runs the venue, is also running the Copper Box. We actually think in many respects it will support and add to the, the quality of the boxing offer within the East End. The profits from the Copper Box will subsidise cheap swimming at the Aquatic Centre. So the hope is that big nights will play a role in finding future Olympic swimmers and divers as well as boxers. Adrian Warner, BBC London News.